Hey guys, um, me here. You, most of the people watching this video probably have no clue who I am, but uh, that's fine. Keep it that way. Uh, <clears throat> but what I do want to say, just a few things real quick here, is not. Uh, Okay, yeah, one shouldn't believe everything you read on the internet. Um, but to go along with that point, you um, you shouldn't just disbelieve everything you read on the internet either. Uh, you should really uh, get your sources right. Um, figure out where it's where it's coming from. Uh, you know, people will lie. Yeah, it's part of life. People will cheat. Yeah, it's part of life. Uh, these people in high school who are making your life miserable, you know, stabbing you in the back, as you said, um, they're not your friends. It shouldn't come as a shock. It's been happening for four years now. Um, you know, who cares? They are not your friends. Um, you shouldn't be participating in that that would lead people to believe that these rumors are true in the first place. Um, you know, these things can be easily avoided. Uh, and there's no need to make a point about it by pretending to be dead and then being mad that no one texts you. You're supposed to be dead. Of course, no one texts you to see if you are alright. Um, you know, if anyone did, it would kind of be in bad taste, I, I think. Um, <laughs> but... It's just, um, high school is full of people being overdramatic, full of people being stupid. So why counteract that by being extremely dramatic? It, it's not sensical. Um, and like I said, you should not be surprised that these people um, say these things about you. They're not your friends. These are just, everyone's in competition to see who can be a bigger jerk, really, and why are they, why do you want these people to be your friends? Why are you surprised these people did that to you? Um, they don't care who they hurt. They're stupid high school kids, okay? Um, guess what? It's senior year. You're going to graduate. You're not going to see any of these people again. You're going to hopefully go on to college and have a better life than most people who graduate high school who don't go on to college. and plug away at uh, dead-end minimum wage jobs, uh, and then, you know, who has the last laugh? Who cares that someone spread a rumor when you were 17 about whether or not you were um, bulimic or pregnant or, oh, I forget what the other rumors were, but, yeah, um, you know, the way to respond to a rumor is not to pretend someone's dead. <laughs> uh, it's, it's to... Just don't even refute. It. You don't even have to do that. Just go on. There's there's no point in being this dramatic and drastic about it. People have been spreading rumors for years, and they still are, and they still will be in 20 years, and 40 years, and 100 years. It's just part of life. There are bad people out there. There are liars out there. There are people who don't care who they hurt. They just want to be uh, seen better than you. So just. Get used to it, okay? The way to be better is not to do the same thing they're doing. It's to not do that. It's to take a step above them. Um, and like I said, participating in acts that would lead people to even believe these rumors are true is also uh, something that you should think about. Uh, you know, people are going to believe what they want to anyway, so even if you're a good person, yeah, some people are going to believe rumors about you. It's just how it is. Um, you, know, you would have been just as offended if someone had come up to you and said, uh, Hey, are you pregnant? Uh, I mean, because you mentioned that in the video, that people asked if you if you were pregnant, you were treating you different. Then, you know, you were offended by that. You're offended if people don't talk to you about it. Just, it doesn't matter. Who cares? It is stupid high school drama that you really don't need to be involved in because there's no point in it. Uh, you're never going to sort out who said what, who believed what, uh, and in the end, 
99.9% of the people that you know in high school, you're going to go on, never talk to again, never see again, and never think about again, because they're unimportant, immature people who don't deserve the time of day, who will probably go on and in five years say, yeah, that was stupid, I should have done that. And then also think, well, that person pretended to be dead. Uh, yeah, that was funny. Um, you know, I don't know. It's just, just all much too dramatic. And, you know, just, <laughs> who cares? It's literally, that is all I can say. It is a rumor. Let it go. You know, you can do all these things and be mad about it and be depressed about it, or you can say, I'm never going to sort this issue out anyway. I'm going to graduate and never talk to these people again anyway. They're not actually my friends. So who who cares? You know, who gives a flying star, you know, what, who said what, or when it was said, or any of those things that you mentioned in the video. It does not... Matter. It is literally unimportant in the grand scheme of things. Does it matter that in high school so someone started to ask you about you? And you know, when you die on your deathbed, are you even thinking about, you know, someone who spread the rumor that you ate the last Pop Tart? I don't think so. Like, it doesn't really matter when it's all said and done. And um, I think it's important to life to realize that there are much bigger things to life, much things bigger as far as life goes than rumors and high school drama because um it's just uh, I don't know, much more important things, considerably much more important things that you can be involved in and concerned about other than rumor spread in high school and trying to make a point to people because it won't work. There's been good people in the world since it began trying to Avoid those sort of things. And guess what? People are still spread rumors even today. So, just don't worry about it. Let it go. Anyway.